suspended from listing on eBay for seven days. What is up, Stuff Seller here? It is Monday, May 11th, and coming at you with another What Sold video for the weekend. And I'm going to talk a little bit about an experience I've had with uh, eBay over this weekend. My last video was a large lot of knives, and I had a little trouble with uh, one of the knives that I listed. So we're going to talk about that after we go over what sold and uh, let's get into it so nine items going out today this is what sold over the weekend i did pack a couple things up on saturday morning so this is from saturday afternoon until monday morning so first thing is this kenner vintage 1977 ssp car and it's one of those cars that used to have the um, pull string and this thing would take off. Sold this for $39.99 plus shipping. So $39.99 plus shipping. Pretty cool. These Herodice had these for a while. Oh, I picked this up in that Disney lot where I had several boxes that I uncovered. And that sold. These are Hera's dice. I believe they're Bakelite or something to that nature. I'm not sure. Had them listed for a while at $9.99 and then just took an offer of five bucks plus shipping. So five bucks plus shipping. Get these out of my inventory. Next up is this Sony. HDR camera. I have it in a bag. It comes with the charger. Picked this up at a Goodwill. I think I paid $9.99 for it. $9.99 at a Goodwill. Had it listed for $79.99 and took a best offer of $69 plus shipping. $69. Next up is this old school Panasonic cassette recorder. I included three tapes with it, Maxwell tapes. Had this listed for a while. I think I picked this up at an estate sale last year. Uh, I don't think I paid more than five bucks for it. And sold that for $35, uh, but I did free shipping on it because a lot of the other ones had free shipping. I just wanted to be competitive. $35 free shipping. Probably cost me anywhere between $10 and $12 to uh, ship that. Next up is this Hot Wheels police station. New in the box with a little car. The station. This is from 1996. Pretty cool little graphics up there. Ended up selling that for $69.99 plus shipping. $69.99. This is one of my videos you could see back. I don't think I paid more than 20 bucks for it at the most. So uh, $69.99. I picked it up in a lot of stuff and it was one price. So it's hard to determine exactly, but I would say no more than 20 bucks. Uh, DVD, THX 1138, George Lucas, Director's Cut. Did not watch this. I was meaning to watch it, never got around to it. Had it listed, $9.99 free ship. $9.99 free ship. PS4, NAC, game, $9.99 plus ship. $9.99 plus shipping on that. These are eight HM train tracks in the box, unopened. Uh, I was 
say this is new old stock and sold that for $19.99 plus shipping $19.99 plus shipping and I picked this up in uh, the lot where I had the Hot Wheel set so this is all one lot and I believe there was a box of a bunch of trains in new in the box new old stock and I paid 40 bucks for the small little box, which is part of the lot. So 20 bucks on that. And lastly is the Wing Commander Super Nintendo in the box. And what did I get for that? $15 free ship. $15, it's lightweight, it'll go um, first class. I can't even remember where I got this but I didn't pay much for it, I know that. So, nine things going out. Stick around, we're gonna talk a little bit about my eBay suspension and uh, what happened. All right, Stuff Seller here, May 11th. Talking a little bit about eBay and what transpired over the weekend. So on my last video, you saw that I picked up a bunch of knives, boxes of knives, and actually those were police auction knives, and they some of them had evidence tape around them, so I had to cut the tape off. But they were all police auction knives. So anything that the police finds that is illegal, they do not put in auction. They get rid of it, they destroy it. Only those knives that are still legal, they will put them in auction, give them to an auction house and have them auction them out. So I started listing a bunch of knives um, over the, the weekend and during the week and listed this guy right here. So this is a dagger. It is the cold steel ink made in Japan dagger with the sheath, let me pick up the sheath, with this sheath here, saw there, there was a lot of uh, knives from this company, Cold Steel Ink, and saw that there was a lot of them that were sold, a lot of them that was purchased, and I listed this at auction. So I listed this at auction. I started it off at $99. I saw one that sold for like $150. So I started it off at $99. I didn't think anything of it. I thought it was a perfectly good knife coming from the police auction, coming from all the knives that I purchased. So I listed it. Received the notice today saying they took the list, eBay took the listing down and gave, gave me a seven day restriction for selling. So that means I can't list anything for seven days. So anything that's listed can still be sold, but the way they worded it was that the search would be kind of disabled, I guess, where if somebody was searching for a certain item, my item would not pop up, I guess, but it'd still be there, which I don't know, it doesn't make sense. I guess if it still has watchers, the watchers can see it. Previously, I had a three-day restriction because I listed a paratrooper knife and that was taken down, received a three-day restriction. So this constituted a seven-day restriction. Now, like, I'm appealing it. I emailed eBay and I told them that this was purchased at a police auction. Don't know why it was taken down. I've received a lot of listings for this company's knife and didn't understand it and it's going to hurt my business although i'm not full-time i am part-time but um you know i do rely on some of that money so that is what happened over the weekend my sales still occurred i sold that stuff um over the weekend but with the seven day restriction just means that i'm not going to be able to list anything and my sales are gonna 
really plummet. They're gonna go down because people aren't gonna be able to search for my items. So hopefully um, they reply soon and let me know. If not, I won't be able to start listing again until next week. So I'll still be sourcing, finding some stuff, looking at things. I have some stuff that is currently at auction that is going pretty well. Uh, one of the Jerobi cars from one of my videos back that's currently at auction and currently at $250, the orange car. Not the one in the box, I haven't listed that one yet. Um, one of the airplanes I don't think I showed in one of the videos, it's a Cox made in the USA gas powered airplane. That's currently at auction. Uh, I believe it's $75 or close to that that's uh, going on right now. So uh, some pretty good auctions that are going on, but I know that my sales are gonna trickle down uh, based on this restriction so we'll see what happens so like subscribe follow and i'll keep you posted stuff seller out